hey everybody welcome back to our channel so it is Wednesday and I wanted to show you guys the haul I was able to get we went to our favorite grocery store Harris Teeter some really really good news that I hear I'm not sure if it's confirmed yet I think it is that there is going to be a super doubles happening um, Sunday the 7th through the 9th Sunday Monday and Tuesday in our area I think we're we're included but I'm not sure that I will shop and if I do shop I'm not sure that I will shop for food items I may shop for personal personal feminine hygiene items if I do shop because I went over a little bit of my grocery haul today but I did want to show you what I was able to get so I'm gonna span the haul I am trying to make a very concerted effort to really be um, positive about my smart points my Weight Watchers smart points so I did go over a little bit but I will show you what I was able to get so this week the um, Arnold sandwich thins they're 100 calories they were buy one get one free so each of these were like a dollar and between a dollar 59 and a dollar 99 I can't remember and then I had a 55 cents off coupon that doubled to a dollar 10 I think I paid 89 cent for these I think they were a dollar 99 so I got two of those because I had two coupons and I think these are like two or three I think they're three smart points and I was going to get some fat free cheese to do like grilled cheese sandwiches but they did not have any so I did get the sandwich thins and the, the kids and I can still have sandwiches because we have meat um, cabbage green cabbage this week is 49 cents a pound so I was able to get two cabbages I'm gonna do some cabbage steaks for cook ahead um, I got whoop I did I got this smucker sugar-free orange marmalade this was like 379 and uh, Weight Watcher journey to healthy this was in her April empties so she recommended it and then um, a peek inside Darlene uh, she recommended it as well so I'm gonna give it a try I do like orange marmalade and see it's uh, sugar-free so zero smart points for one tablespoon I got just the Harris Teeter Greek non-fat yogurt this is in strawberry this will probably be a couple of smart points but they oh no that says 130 calories I was trying oh no I picked up the wrong ones I will not be eating these the end okay there were some that were like 80 calories and I thought those were the ones I was getting uh, because I would have just gotten the den and light and fit had I known these were 120 calories so that was a mistake on my part I'll find a lovely person who wants to eat these high calorie yogurts and I will get myself something different um, it will be okay though if I don't if I don't have it maybe I thought I was picking up the plane and was gonna use some of the orange marmalade inside I can't remember um, the Sargento's Sweet Balance, these were 89 cents by the way, I will tell you they were 89 cents. The Sargento's Sweet Balance Breaks, this has the Monterey Jack Natural Cheese, Dried Cranberries, and Dark Chocolate Covered Peanuts. These were on sale two for six. They two for six. I think they were two for six, so three dollars a piece. And I have a 75 cents off coupon that doubled to $1.50, so I think I paid $1.50 each. And there, there are three of these in this container. I think they're between seven and nine smart points. But just for a snack or if I have extra points or I'm trying to get into in some protein or whatever, this is a quick something that I can just throw in the bag or whatever. Um, the good thins, I do like these um, beet that are balsamic vinegar and sea salt. They were on sale for uh, buy one get one free so each box was $1.99. The coupon I had ran out on that one and I was just really bummed about that but you can have like 25 to 29 of these for like three or four smart points. So these are really a great snack. They're really really thin but the balsamic vinegar and sea salt flavor is really good. Um, please don't judge these Cheez-Its. They are the reduced fat originals. 29 of these are four smart points. And the reason I got five boxes is they were buy two, get three free this week. So I just went ahead and bought two and got three free. We are going to take a box of these and separate out. We count them out into 29 sets. And so I put some of these in the uh, pantry closet 
and we'll just eat off of one box. I do allow myself to have treats like that every now and again. I got my regular turkey pepperoni for 15 slices. It's two smart points. This is just a Harris Teeter brand. And then the Canadian style bacon. This is 60 points and I think you can have four slices. Up to four slices I think is one smart point. Three slices I think is zero smart points. But you can have up to four slices. I usually do egg muffins when I do make aheads, and I use one or two of these so I get zero points. They did have their regular Harris Teeter pasta sauce, and this is the lowest calorie one that they had at 80 calories for a half a cup. And uh, these were 97 cents today, so four was the max number you could get. I did get four. Y'all, we are. I was so embarrassed. Um, we actually ran out of toilet paper here at the house today, so. Um, I was borrowing to toilet paper out of the kids' bathroom, and I was like, I'm not running out of toilet paper anymore. So I went ahead and got two. Normally, I just get one per week, but I ran out. So I got two of these. I put one, four rolls in their bathroom and four rolls in my bathroom. Um, I think my son was home a couple of days last week, so we just used, I don't know. And then I got my regular two spa paper towels. This was $2.27 for the toilet paper and $0.47 cents a piece for the paper towels. I did get two spaghetti squash and I probably am going to cook both of these at the same time and put them with the pasta so I can do a couple cook ahead meals. I may do this on Sunday and then I'll have lunches for next week. We got bananas and grapes were a $1.79 a pound. So I got two big bunches of grapes because I'm trying to find some different healthy options for us to graze on during the day because we tend to be more grazers. So we're gonna wash those up, throw them in a big container. I did get um, two packages of the diced cabbage, peppers, and onions. This is called Southern Coleslaw. The last one I had had carrots in it, but I made the best, and this was um, $1.79, but I made the best chicken stir fry last night. I was kind of like a chicken fried rice, but I use uh, Southern Coleslaw canned chicken breasts and a box of broccoli and I actually added in some shrimp and it was so delish so I thought I'll get two of those because that's two meals right there I got a bigger bag bigger bag of spinach that was $2.99 it's probably bigger than the one I had last week but we ran out um, two green bell peppers was $1.29 and then I got the bag of the mini bell peppers that was $1.99 log cabin um syrup was on sale this week it was buy one get one free so i got just the original and i got a sugar free and the reason i got this is i'm hosting a baby shower i'm co-hosting a baby shower for a friend we're doing a brunch and we're gonna do like a breakfast bar so it'll be uh, pancakes and waffles and sausages and grits and egg muffins and so i just thought i'd get it while it was on sale it's a couple weeks out but i'll just throw it in the pantry and it'll still be fine and then aunt your mama had buy one get one free waffles so these were two 44 or $1.22 a piece and I just got four of those for the kids. So no cereal this week They'll throw a bag of these in the fridge to use and three bags will go in the outside storage freezer and then we just got our standby of our lactate or Lactose free milk. I still do have from last week one melon one cantaloupe and one pineapple and I will be cutting up those fruit this week, I do have some overripe bananas that I'm going to be making some um, breakfast cookies. I found a recipe on Pinterest. And then I'm also going to be making some banana pancakes. So those four bananas we will use in our make-ahead meals. I'm probably not going to do that until Saturday, though. So this is our haul. We'll go ahead and span for you to be able to see the things that we were able to get. I'm always thankful when I'm able to get lots of um, produce and just some things I, I feel will help my family out. And so I'll show you my budget this week was $75. And I did go over a little bit and I'll tell you where I think I did, but it, it is okay. Um, okay, my balance this week was $86.05. So I was over by $11, but my coupons tendered were $55.39. On this total order for Evix, I had um, $48.69 in year to date. The first week of May, we've saved over $1,045. So where I could have shaved off a little bit, um, 
I believe if I would have only bought one spaghetti squash, I think these were like $1.99 a pound. So that was a couple pounds. If I had only gotten one bag of the grapes, but I didn't get any strawberries this week, I probably would have come out a little bit cheaper. Um, only one thing of toilet paper, that was $2 and some change. And then maybe if I had gotten only one head of cabbage, that would have taken the total down just a little bit. And then maybe just one Canadian bacon because there's several slices in here. But the kids eat the same meals that I eat. So I don't make two separate meals. If I'm doing smart points, in a sense, they're doing smart points too because I cook for them the same that I cook for myself. So anyway, we were over about $11. Um, I do try to stay within my budget, but I feel like for the extra produce, I was okay this time. I did have a few coupons, not as many as I normally do, but praise the Lord for a larger food budget this week. So anyway, that's our grocery haul for the week. I'm gonna do a video on just some meals I could make with the things I have in the house. We do really hope that you enjoyed this video. If you have any questions, leave us a comment below. We're so thankful to have you come by our channel. Like this video, give us a thumbs up. That would help us out. And if you're not subscribed to our channel, do that. Hit the little bell so you never miss an upload from us. And until next time we shop, bye.